Hi everyone, this is Ramakrishna. Welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to discuss AP Set 2018 Linear Algebra Question Number 14 from Papa 2. And the question is, which of the following is not a basis for the vector space R cube over R? And the four options are option number what set uh, consisting three vectors 1, 2, 0, 2, 3, 1, minus 4, 7, 1. And second option 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0. Option number 3, 1, 2, 3, 3, 2, 4 minus 1, 6, 0. And option number 4, 3, minus 1, 2, 4, 3, 2, 1, minus 9, 2. Okay. So here the question is about uh, regarding basis of a vector space. So first we recall the definition of uh, basis of a vector space. So first we recall the definition. So definition is a subset S yes, of a vector space V of F is said to be basis set of V if it satisfies two conditions. First one, S is linearly independent. And second one, the linear span of S is V. That is L of S is equals to V. Okay. So this is the definition of basis for a vector space. And uh, here we have an important note that is a subset S of a vector space V of F is linearly independent if debt of S is not equal to 0. That is determinant of the given set is not equals to 0. Then the given set of vectors are linearly independent. Okay. So we will use this uh, to check whether the given set of uh, vectors are linearly independent or linearly dependent. Okay, now coming to the problem, here the first option is uh, set consisting three vectors 1, 2, 0, 2, 3, 1, minus 4, 7, minus 1. So, if it is not a basis, then it must be linearly dependent because basis means it must satisfy two properties. So, it, uh, given set is linearly independent and the linear span of S is equal to V. So, first we will check the property whether the given set is linearly dependent or linearly independent. If it is linearly independent, then it must uh, form a basis because here the vector space is of dimension 3 over R and uh, it is a set uh, consisting 3 vectors. So first we have to check whether the given set of vectors are linearly independent or linearly dependent. So we will check uh, option wise. So first we are we will check the option number one. So in the option number one, the given set of vectors are 1, 2, 0, 2, 3, 1, minus 4, 7, minus 1. So determinant of that uh, set. So first we will find the determinant of that set. So option one. So taking option one, determinant, that is determinant of 1, 2, 0, uh, 2, 3, 1, minus 4, 7 minus 1 so usual determinant value 3 by 3 so that is 1 into by neglecting first column and first row we will get this is uh, 3 into minus 1 minus 3 minus 7 minus 2 into by neglecting second column and uh, first row so we will get uh, this is uh, minus 2 minus of minus plus 4 plus 0 into last vector this is uh, 14 minus of minus plus 12 so this value is equals to this is uh, minus 10 minus 4 so which is equal to minus 14 not equals to 0 so clearly the set of vectors is linearly independent set so option number one is not correct because the question is about not a basis for the given vector space so clearly the determinant of the first set of vectors are linearly independent so this is a basis for a given vector space r cube so now we'll check the option number two so that is determinant of option number two vectors are one zero one zero one 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 zero so determinant of one zero one 0 1 1 and the last vector 1 1 0 and here the determinant value is 1 into 0 minus 1 minus 0 into vector plus 1 into 0 minus 1 so here 0 into means uh, by neglecting second uh, column and first row this is uh, 0 minus 1 so this value is equal to minus 1 
plus 0 minus 1 which is equal to minus 2 this is also not equal to 0 so linearly independent now coming to third option the set of vectors are 1 2 3 3 2 4 and this is uh, minus 1 6 0 and the determinant value is uh, this is equals to so here we have third row as a zero element so we can expand that along this third row so by you taking minus one into by neglecting third row and first column we have the determinant is two into four that is eight minus six next value minus six into by neglecting third column and sorry third row and second column we have this is 4 minus 9 plus 0 into this is 2 minus 6 so this value is equals to minus 2 and this is minus uh, 30 which is equals to minus 32 not equal to 0 this is also linearly independent that means these three sets forms a basis for given vector space r cube now we will check the option number four that is uh, determinant of the vectors three minus one two four three two and one minus nine and two so determinant is three into by neglecting first uh, column and first row this is uh, 6 minus of minus plus uh, 18 minus of minus plus 1 into by neglecting uh, second column and first row this is uh, 8 minus 2 plus 2 into by neglecting last column and uh, first row this is uh, minus 36 minus 3 okay so this is uh, equals to on simplification we get this is uh, 72 plus 6 minus 78 so here 72 plus 6 means uh, plus 78 and this is minus 78 equal to 0 so here the determinant of the given vectors is equal to 0 so by using this node point whenever the determinant value is not equal to 0 the set of vectors are linearly independent but here the determinant value is equal to 0 so set is linearly dependent so the last option so your option number four that is uh, three minus one two four three two and uh, one minus nine two it is linearly dependent so so this is not form a basis for r cube over r hence the option number four is correct is it clear i hope you like this video if you like the video please share subscribe thanks for watching